Light is an important part of our daily life. We all have seen bulbs providing light. When we press the switch, the light gets on and off. We all have seen the CFL bulbs. But do we know how it works? Let's know about the working principle. Before that, let's go through precisely its invention. So, a man named Thomas Edison, created in 1879, was the greatest innovation with the incandescent bulb. Which went on for quite a long span of time, but with time people started upgrading themselves. These incandescent bulbs generated light, heating tungsten filament with nearly 2000 degrees Celsius, or more. But this method of generating light affected the greenery and greenhouse gas produced with high power consumption, which had a bad effect of increasing the temperature in the atmosphere. Keeping these things in mind, Edison's invention was replaced with a surprise the new bulb. Known as the compact fluorescent light bulb, commonly known as the CFL bulb. Today, in this video we will learn its parts and working principles. It consists of three major parts like screw base or housing electronic ballast and spiral lamp at the ballast there are some small components these are capacitor rectifier bridge transistors choke feedback transformer and fuse These bulbs contain argon and mercury vapor within the spiral-shaped tube instead of filament light bulbs. Let's see how it works. Bulbs need an AC supply that facilitates the changing of the functionality of anode and cathode. In a CFL bulb electric current flows. When the electricity is passed through a filament, which is usually made of tungsten, of electrodes, the temperature rises about 900 degrees Celsius. These accelerated electrons strike mercury and argon atoms, which arise from low-temperature plasma. This process generates the radiation of mercury in ultraviolet form. The vacuum pipe or tube contains a luminophore, it is in the inner part, and its main function is to convert ultraviolet light into visible light. The fluorescent coating painted inside the tube is stimulated by ultraviolet light, this is because the coating absorbs the energy emitting visible light. These bulbs consist of a switch mode converter. This functions on a high frequency, which acts as a replacement of ballast and starter assembly. This ballast helps in the kick start, and then stimulates the flow of current once electricity passes. In this way, CFL bulb works. Friends, if you want to learn more about LED, share your comment. Thank you. Let's grow up. Never stop your learning.